today we are going to be unboxing the Harry Potter bar box. When I saw bar box have teamed up with Harry Potter to do a box, I was so excited and then I was so disappointed that it was not for old customers, that it was just for the new customers. But then we could get it as an add-on. I was salty, I'm not gonna lie, I was super salty. But I decided I want to get them because I'm a huge Harry Potter fan. I have all the books, I have a lot of merch, I have even decor for my house, and I want all the toys for Venus and Apollo. So I add them on for this month box. If you're interested to see what Venus and Apollo got, keep on watching. What is in there? What is this? What is this? Oh my goodness! Why there's boxes inside boxes? Because I think like I I ordered the Harry Potter stuff separate. They put it like in one big bark box and then there's also the normal bark box probably. This is Harry Potter. It smells good in there. <laughs> she was pushing to open it. She pushed over her nose. What is this supposed to be? I don't know. As a Harry Potter fan, I did not recognize this. What is this? Is that that thing that, that um, Dumbledore used in the first one to grab light? It's a wand. Oh, that's a wand. <laughs> so he doesn't forget that I have to open it for you, okay? I'm guessing this is the one of this month. Yeah. That's probably the normal bark box for this yes. one. And look at Venus, look. This one is as not as cute as the Harry Potter stuff, I know. <laughs> I know. <laughs> look, very great. You want this. And the pumpkin honey recipe. You know you like to share it, right? I give the other half to Apollo and they both love this type of toy and the pumpkin recipe is one of their favorites. They love everything pumpkin. They are just like me. They love fall and pumpkin everything. They like all the treats that came in this month box. So that was a success. Oh, she's slobbering all over the phoenix. Flats. According to their individual traits, we decide which house is 
Each of them, so Venus is from the house of Slytherin. She's very clever and she's always determined. Shrek is from the house of Ravenclaw. He's very intelligent and he loves to observe everything everybody's doing. And Apollo, he's from the house of Gryffindor. He's very brave, very daring, ready for any action, any adventure. You know, in Harry Potter, Hagrid's house have a lot of pumpkins. So I wanted to take the pictures outside with all our fall decor, because I think it feels very Harry Potter-esque. <laughs> they look so cute. They look adorable. Uh, excuse me, sir. I've been, oh, I don't want her to sit so long. I don't like how she's laying down. Hey. Venus, I don't Shrek! You will probably see you there, buddy. Venus, Apollo! Let me see the, shri the trees for Shrek. Shrek! Look! Venus' favorite was the phoenix. I think it's because it has so many different textures. It has a crinkle, it's also fuzzy in the wings, it has a soft tail, and it has like a squeaky in the middle. It's the perfect toy all around. She loved it also. It's one of the largest toys we have ever received in Box. I dare to say it's the largest one that we have ever received, and she loved the look how happy she is. beautiful but it's not their favorite they never like these type of balls anyway they are like rubbery material bouncy but it's beautiful so i'm gonna keep it in their closet as an ornament like with all the other balls just because it's beautiful the one in the other hand they loved it Apollo loved to shoe on hard toys and this one was the perfect texture for him. He absolutely loved that he was chewing on it for a little while and I cannot give it to Venus. Venus have a tooth that needs some fixing so she cannot play with it but Apollo enjoyed it a lot and he loved it. The other toys like the hat, I'm not gonna give it to them right now. I'm gonna wait a few days until they get tired of these ones and then I give them the other toys. I don't like to give them so many toys at the same time because then they ignore them. But in a few days when these ones are broken or old, I will give them the rest.